How well do you know prepositions in English? Let's find out. Hi, and welcome to the Espresso English podcast, where you can improve your English in just a few minutes a day. My name is Shana, and I'm the teacher at Espresso English. Make sure to visit the website espressoenglish.net, where you can get online courses and eBooks that will help you learn English even faster. Let's get started with today's lesson. This is a quiz lesson. I'll show you a sentence and give you three possible words to complete it. You'll have five seconds to decide which is the correct preposition before I show you the right answer. There are 15 questions total. Keep track of your score and let me know how you did. When you're learning English, you want to get everything right, and these tiny words like prepositions can be very challenging. My advanced English grammar course teaches you the rules and exceptions of the English language in detail. It will help you understand English grammar clearly and use it more confidently and correctly. Click on the link in the video or in the description for more information and to sign up for advanced English grammar. Okay, are you ready to try this prepositions quiz? Let's get started. Number one, he gave the presentation, although, despite, or during being ill. The correct answer is, he gave the presentation despite being ill. Number two, I can't drink coffee throughout, within, or without sugar. It's too bitter. The correct sentence is, I can't drink coffee without sugar. It's too bitter. Number three, I got all the questions right, among, beside, or except the last one. The correct sentence is, I got all the questions right, except the last one. Number four, I want to snack on something salty, as, by, or like potato chips. The correct sentence is, I want to snack on something salty, like potato chips. Number five, my house is across, close, or near the university. The correct answer is, my house is near the university. Number six, our plans will depend of, on, or with the weather. The correct sentence is, our plans will depend on the weather. Number seven, she's been to above, beyond, or over 50 countries. The correct sentence is, she's been to over 50 countries. Number eight, the fabric costs $20 by, for, or per meter. The correct answer is, the fabric costs $20 per meter. Number nine, the figurine fell away, off, or out the shelf and smashed on the floor. The correct sentence is, the figurine fell off the shelf and smashed on the floor. Number 10, there are cherry trees all along amidst or aside the road. The correct sentence is, there are cherry trees all along the road. Number 11, these grapes are sweeter as, of, or than those. The correct sentence is, these grapes are sweeter than those. Number 12, this road will take you straight in, into, or onto the city center. The correct sentence is, this road will take you straight into the city center. Number 13, we must mail the letter by, since, or until Friday.
The correct sentence is, we must mail the letter by Friday. Number 14. We watched TV for, from, or since three hours. The correct sentence is, we watched TV for three hours. Number 15. There were numerous mistakes alongside, beneath, or throughout the article. The correct answer is, there were numerous mistakes throughout the article. All right, how did you do? How many correct out of 15? I hope you enjoyed this quiz lesson. You can learn a lot more inside my Advanced English Grammar course. We cover all the verb tenses, prepositions, adjectives, adverbs, sentence structure, and more complex grammar issues. But don't worry, I'll make them easy for you to understand. That's all for now. Thanks for joining me today, and I'll talk to you in the next video. If you want more great English lessons, visit EspressoEnglish.net where you can sign up by email to receive a free ebook with 500 plus real English phrases. You'll also find online courses to help you improve your English fast, even if you don't have much time to study. Keep practicing your English, and I hope you have a wonderful day.